Get out of yours. I'm going to put this 275 watt. Just a heat lamp from the bathroom. Normally have four of these. You can turn two at a time or any of your choice to throw out the maximum amount of heat for your bathroom as well as, 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 well as having a lot of light. But these are now being phased out and replaced with um, CFLs which are probably a quarter of the brightness of these and don't throw out heat whatsoever which sucks so we'll have to just gonna buy a little stock up we've got to stock up on these this is just a cheap and nasty one as you can see the filament sort of come off but yeah if you look carefully this camera can't pick it up but it'll look like there's this white corrosion on the um where the filament connects to the stems that go to the cap Edison screw but they're all actually de degraded and that's what's caused the filament to come off because these lights do run pretty damn hot. So I'm gonna finish it off with this microwave, microwave oven transformer on a ballast. Just for extra arm um, long. See how long it takes for this to melt. So I'm gonna solder this to the end and one to the screw so I can connect them under that because I don't have a, um, a socket for these. So yeah, let's get this thing wired up and see what happens. Okay, viewers, this is all hooked up. Just like that. Now I'm going to plug in the power. Hopefully I get that, that filament is touching. We'll see what happens when I turn the power on. Wow, look at that. The filament is somewhat trying to roll itself. Arcing itself out, and then a light bulb is filling with smoke. I want explosions. No, the filament hasn't touched the rod itself, so it hasn't fixed the bulb. Get it at a certain angle so the filament touches and holds on, but I won't do that. Okay, now it's just a domino effect. The bulb is destroyed now. Interesting. Ah, oh, damn it. I only just spotted that, so push that back down there. Uh, not too bad at damage, thank God. That would have been a hell of a bang if that had arced out and shorted. So, it's bloody cord to stay back. Okay, that's better. The wind must have blew that. It's a pretty damn strong wind today. It's lucky I saw that. That would have been a hell of a pop. There we go. Looks better in real life than it does in the camera. There we go, now arc inside the bowl. It's completely got an open circuit in there. Yeah, and melted the little stalk away. Yep. Alright oh, viewers, she's completely gone, so power off. So yeah. Okay, if yours a close inspection, you can see a burnt the metallic um shining off it. It's just started to bulge the glass. You can see the filament's a bit discoloured and it's melted that stalk right off. So it went there and it hit the earth and it yeah, melted the glass. That blob of metal is what's left of it. There you go. Cool.